Hey nerds, Jim here. This week I got to read Star Wars Dawn of the Jedi, Prisoner of Bogan. This basically takes place after Dawn of the Jedi, go figure. Um, to be honest, I don't know if you remember my review from back then, but I wasn't thrilled with the way Dawn of the Jedi turned out. I loved how it started, not a big fan of how it turned out. So I was a little leery picking up this book and seeing where they were going to go. It was okay. Um, they spent a lot of time reintroducing us to this world and the characters like the Jirniers that they had in the first book. I, I really did enjoy, though, the interaction between Zesh, who's now banished or a prisoner of Bogan, and um, Dagan Locke, who had already been there and discovers he's got basically a new roomie on the planet. Uh, I like where they're going with this because Dagan Locke was basically banished to Bogan for a premonition that involves Zesh. So I like how they're pulling this all in together and the masters seem to have something going on that they're not gonna show their cards yet, but it seems like they have some plan going on that isn't exactly Jedi-esque. It seems like it might be a little on the dark side. So I'm very curious how this is gonna play out. I am gonna continue reading because I hope they continue that interaction between Zesh and Dagan Locke, but I can only give it three out of five nerd skulls.